Oh, wow. And of course, as always, we're gonna go to Go for a dash deck here. right into a fair. <laughs> yeah. I mean, even if he did get this back, it, it was it was yeah. kind of ballsy because he was not going to die. Bowser at 13. Ooh, the Waveland. DJ is kind of smoothing. Up throw into up air, yes. <laughs> I think I think the the C4 triggered his up smash. <laughs> it's proximity based. Oh. Okay, nice. Oh. Okay. Oh, Ooh. yeah. Gets the F2 and kills him. That gives him the Cooper fist. <laughs> Interesting choice. Well, there we go. Evening out the stocks, but still, a BJ a good amount of percent behind right now. Yeah. Um, Ledge trap situation for Snake. As always. This time no counter on his enemy, so he, he yeah, can so use the up smash a bit more freely. Exactly. Dark Thunder, oh. he needs to get off the ledge. And yeah. then um but he gets up to it. Yeah. Since Bowser's rolls are pretty slow, he definitely Yeah, Bowser, his worst position is probably at the ledge, yeah. because all of his get-up options, they're quite slow. Yeah. And if you have a hitbox out, you can actually hit them, yeah. and also you can react easily to his rolls. But at the same time, he's also just as good as ledge trapping himself. Yeah. Ooh, gets away with the, with the up B. That's a, that's a thing, like, snakes... It's better for them usually to recover high because they can mix up their movement with mm -hmm. the mm -hmm. with the neutral B uh, reverse with the reverse neutral B. Yeah. It's basically un unless you have a very good read, you can't really contest it if they're going that high. Yeah. <coughs> but BJ, I feel like he's like playing far away, and mm -hmm. he's waiting for his opportunity to get in a dash attack yeah. or to find an opening, and then he will try to convert off of it mm -hmm. into a ledge trap situation. Like right away, he's he's dash dancing again, and most likely he'll like as soon as Dark Thunder gets close, he'll use a burst option to get him off yeah. of him. Okay, interesting. Goes for the down air. Oh, wow, okay, very juicy. Caught the landing I feel like the uh, BJ more so than most other snakes I've seen is very, like, bait heavy with his dash dances. He goes very close to the enemy and just yeah. dash dances a lot. Like, I mean, a snake's dash attack's really hard to punish. It's yeah, super fast true. move and it has low end lag. Yeah. So. But oh, Dark Thunder, he's yeah. been doing an amazing job catching the landing. So yeah, yeah. BJ. Got him with the up smash and with the up tilt. It's just staying on the ground and catching him once he's actually there. Yeah. yeah. Very close first game, but it goes to Dark Thunder. Interestingly enough. Do you think he will counter pick the snake at the stage? Or will there be small battlefield again? <laughs> I think I think the stage picking phase is eliminated from our rule set. I think statistically you can say that this is the most played stage right now. Yeah, definitely. But yeah, BJ, once again, he's playing the keep away game, waiting for a Dark Thunder to approach. And as soon as he gets too close, he'll try to probably dash attack him or mm -hmm. most likely dash attack him, yeah. <laughs> or Nikita. <laughs> 
And that, it's, that's interesting how much he uses Nikita on stage in this matchup. And it's been working out very well. Ooh. But Dark Thunder, I have to say, is really... It's really uh, keeping up, up the juggles and keeping mm -hmm. Snake in the air. And he's also really good at catching uh, catching his landings most yeah. of the time. I mean, he has got a huge up tilt and a really <laughs> yeah. good up smash that yeah. you can't contest from above. But still. It's also Bowser oh, on, the, the on the ground is pretty fast. Yeah, it's it's like he's the heaviest character. Yeah, and it, he, it's his, uh, dash, his dash is actually really fast. Like he's running really fast stupid. too. It was better in, in melee and brawl where he was like a tank rolling across yeah. the ground. I mean, he he doesn't have like the up throw up air kill confirm like he had yeah, in Smash yeah. Four, but God bless. he he also now has the universal fr frame three jump squad because every yeah, character. So yeah. that that makes a big difference. That's really what what I kind of dislike about Bowser's design in this game. It's just. He's, a, he's a really fast character yeah. for being that heavy. Yeah. Yeah. He's so fast, he has so much kill power, he lives forever. But even though BJ actually on stage, it, it really doesn't look too bad what he's doing. But Dark Thunder just always manages to close out the stock. Yeah. And I think... Um, I'm not sure, but I think the Nikita offstage hasn't been working that well because I feel like Bowser's up B just yeah, goes, it just tanks B. through. Now will he catch the landing? No, goes to the ledge. The C4 is right on the right mm -hmm. side. Yeah. Okay, interesting well, <laughs> down B I there. Think, I, I think he could have, instead of like pulling another grenade, he could have like uh, oh. done another up tilt. Yeah. Oh, this time oh, he hits him. Okay. I, I think. Oh. Ooh. I think. Was that the was that the grenade? No, uh, he he did a second Nikita once he he f jumped off stage. Okay. That kind of like flew down to and hit Bowser still. Interestingly enough. So, both at one stock each. Still very doable for both of them. Oh, Ooh, wow. nice pivot grab. Recovers high. Oh, oh wow. Okay. <laughs> he chased him, him down, down and <laughs> used his flame breath. I mean, if it worked, that would have been a lot of damage. To yeah, be fair. for sure. Alright, BJ, bring it back. Back throw. Little by little. Will it? Oh. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, the previous times he always caught his landing with the up tilt, and this time he probably expected oh, him nice. to land on the yeah. platform and shield. <gasps> this is very close. Nice. I, was, I was going to say it was like a la Bowser just needed one hit at that yeah, point or, yeah, or a side yeah. B and it most likely would have killed if, yeah. it, if he hit a platform. It was but basically a last hit situation for both of them. Yeah, although in Snake's case, I think up tilt was really the only yeah, move where he could have yeah. like KO'd like KO'd that. Right or away, or yeah. obviously a smash, but yeah, he found the up tilt. Yeah. Very nice. Just jumping over his, I don't know what it was, F tilt or jab. Very clean. Are we gonna go small battlefield? Is it time? Oh yes, finally. I was waiting. I was waiting for BJ's music counter pick. Oh, what is this music from? I feel like I know it. Uh, I think he went to the... Oh, the snake gear. music. Yeah, the yeah, shadow... Shadow Moses or something like that. It was... I don't know. I think it, you, can, you can check it on the top left. I think it said something from MGS4. I think Shadow Moses the stage. Yeah, it's oh, MGS4. Yeah, theme, it's yeah. definitely from Shadow Moses, yeah. That's true. The fresh 30. Oh, oh wow. what? What was the oh, setup? Okay, well, he wanted all. BJ! <laughs> oh, they're both going crazy right now. They're going in, yeah. Oh! 
Oh, he he well, did actually connect the down tilt. Yeah. That was interesting. So back, back to the regular game plan. <laughs> yeah. I feel like uh, at the start of Ultimate, every uh, like the, some oh, people said PS2 makes the best games, but I feel like that just has been completely replaced by small battlefields. I mean. Uh, People did really go to PS2 a lot, but yeah. the thing is, uh, what people like about Small Battlefield is that the blast zones, I think in PS2, the blast, uh, blast zones either to the side or the top are really far. I think uh, to the uh, to the top most I'm likely. Sure, I think. Yeah. But uh, in uh, Small Battlefield, I think it's the same as with FD. Yeah. The top blast zone. And the sides are also not too far. I know when the stage came out, a lot of people were posting like clips with times two knockback and were yeah, yeah, saying sure. like, "You really want the stage legal?" legal? Yeah. <laughs> I definitely fell for one or two of them, and I was like, "Damn, I really wanted the stage legal," but I'm happy that we actually got it. Yeah. So will he catch the landing again? Oh, you yeah, don't I feel the like ledge? I feel like every time BJ goes high, I'm almost a bit scared for him. Yeah. Oh, this time he actually clips him with the Nikita. I feel like, uh, as far as I know, uh, you can. But yeah. why is why is he always only getting like the weak hit of the? Because actually, it should like really blast him off, right? Yeah. So the thing is, like there. The thing is, uh, when something hits the Nikita, it it gets deactivated for a few frames. Yeah. But if you then stop controlling it, the hitbox is active again. But I think if you're not controlling it, you only get the weak hit. Oh, okay. Maybe something like that. I'm not sure if it has the strong hit uh, if you're not controlling it anymore. But I feel like that's what he's been doing because you hear that the Nikita clashes with the up B once and then he still gets the Yeah, hit. exactly. Oh, that was a that was a good crouch. Not dead. <laughs> but I feel like BJ has really Either adapter or start to take control because it's looking really good this game yeah, yeah. from him. <laughs> so Dark Thunder now he has to find a way in because BJ is more than happy to play the keep mm -hmm. away game yeah. at these percents. Definitely. BJ is in a pretty comfortable position so far. Yes. I feel like... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, BJ, no. no. What are you doing, oh. BJ? That, that was a massive throw. I'm sorry. I, I, feel, I feel like I jinxed him. First of all, I feel like in that situation right there, Dark Thunder was already center stage. Yeah. He didn't need to go high. Yeah, he yeah, could yeah. have really actually go, gone for the ledge. And then obviously, like, the C4 explosion that, that he blew himself up, that was like... Yeah, that was unfortunate. Yeah. Not sure if he lost track of it. or he if Maybe he thought he would drop it down. All right. We're going small battlefield, boys. Never Game seen four. before. Game four. I mean, it's nice that the stage is getting picked a lot, but I feel like it's, it's kind of like a bad thing for now. But yeah. I think if like it's like almost the only stage played, it's kind of weird again. Yeah, <laughs> true. It is kind of weird, but so far I don't think it's a bad thing yeah. yet. Although it is kind of funny. We've had like 90% of the games on small battlefield in top eight. I was just about to say he's going to dash attack to get <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> he was just waiting for the right moment. He do be diving in though. Okay. Nice sliding F tilt. Not sure if there ever was like an official name for that. Uh, yeah, it's the p it's pivot cancel F tilt. Oh, That's really? What you okay. call it, yeah. For some reason, in, in Graz, we always had F stilt, but I have no idea how that name even came <laughs> okay. to be. I think the S stands for sliding. Oh, okay. I have to stay. I don't, I don't know if it's from the drift of BJ or what, but he's been avoiding the platforms on the side piece quite a bit. He's been living yeah, a lot longer yeah. for that. BJ is going to dash, like, duck. 
BJ has to approach. That's why Dark Thunder is not approaching, because yeah. he's behind. Oh. Which is good. Because um, it's good that Dark Thunder doesn't approach, because he's in the lead, obviously. Yeah. And he's waiting for an op uh, opening. I feel like... Oh, yeah. I was about to say, I feel like... He BJ went in a little bit too yeah, much too and all instantly died for yeah. it. Dash attack, dash attack, yeah. Oh, Ooh. no! He's never I, do I don't think he would have died, but it would have been yeah. so cool. Oh, back at the ledge again. Dash attack. Up, <laughs> Up tilt. tilt, there we go. Okay, BJ bringing it back, and now that I've said it, he'll probably blow himself up again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Damn. That's kind of mean with Bowser's downer because he like ga gains momentum mm -hmm. upwards. Yeah. It, it, there's like a slight delay and then the downer comes. It's even a little evasive, yeah. Because for most characters, you just expect them to drift right into you and into your, in this case, it was Snake's up tilt right yeah. into your move. But with Bowser, you have to be careful about that. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I jinxed him. I'm sorry, BJ. Oh. Oh, I, I, uh, <laughs> that wow, was some okay. spaghetti right there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think Bowser stole some of Mario's spaghetti. Yeah, Ooh, you, should, you, should, you should have that. Yeah. Nice. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, oh how did he get past that? I think he has the sticky on him. One of them. No, it's, yes. on, it's on the flat. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. It's going crazy. It's going crazy. No. Oh, no. Oh, there we Not go. Not that yet. But the next one on a platform may kill him. No. Okay. And his I landing gets catch. I'm just saying, like, Dark Thunder has a pretty high percentage of catching his high recoveries. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, Bowser's up tilt is pretty, pretty huge. Yeah, yeah, definitely.